rewire the challenges and many insightful tasks. Welcome to the Interiors by Design finale, where the true and worthy design star is discovered. Hundreds of Nigerians and interior design hopefuls were on time and excited at the auditions. Some proved their skills. So I brought my portfolio. The presentation is good from what I can see already. At least seems very together. This was just how to combine um, interior traditional look with a modern contemporary home design. Uh, For that, you said you said something with this powerful. I'm giving a shake, please. <laughs> Others were definitely confused. Is like that an elevation, a section, um, a three-point perspective, an axle? It's 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 um it's a two two D two D drawing. Okay. You've come here today. Yeah. You know, tell us about your profession. But no no visuals. So, what's your inspiration when you're creating um, space? Space most times. Space. The space clients. is your inspiration. Space. The clients also. The clients. Um, his taste. His artist. You've just taken pictures of your, your, your stuff, kitchen, maybe. kitchen extract, yeah. yeah with, and you're in all the pictures, you know. I think maybe you don't understand what interior design as a whole is. is I understand yeah. this is one tiny little midget element of interior design. In the end, only the very best 14 were chosen to compete. Come along. From setting the space's mood to uncovering a true designer's secrets, some were carried away with the gloss. So, oh. okay. I know you will like that. Meeting some of the best of the best in the industry, from London-based designer Yinka Elori. There isn't a lot of interior designers in, in Nigeria, um, and I think hopefully it will change in the next few years. <laughs> to industry expert Patrick Koshoni. First thing, you need a lucky break. Now when you get that lucky break, take it as your first and last job. Glamorous Tracy Nwapa. Did you just write that down now? No. no, 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 no. There, I can see it. Creative Omo Anine Modi. I don't immediately see what that source of inspiration um, is here. And Kitchen's best hand, Kunle Dina. We have got 1.5 million of Friends, things that we can pick and put in a kitchen. Everyone had to prove themselves and keep their spots, even if they had to go back to their roots in Ekbet. A beautiful space is a designer's stage to shine and rain. Some couldn't beat the pace. It looks like two different people worked on it. Oh, so this is the sofa. Others definitely had what it takes. I think you guys should just go straight through to the next, the next challenge. So well done. Very well done. Each task had its drama, twists and turns. Fair, we're going to give you the chance to let us know who is going to go back to the drawing board today. Lekon should go back to the drawing board. I want everyone to tell us who might have been the one that put you guys in jeopardy. Sorry, Matilda. She did the painting, so I would put it on her. No, 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 you put this on it. Yes or no? For some, it was sweet victory and welcome on board. I'm going to go with that one. For others, it was back to the drawing board. Zainab, um, you're going to have to go back to the drawing board. As a practicing interior designer in Nigeria, I found that there has been drought of talent and skill in the interior design industry. We deemed it necessary to come up with a show that would help us harness the talent that exists and provide them with a platform to take them to the next level. I'm hoping that we get a lot of nice people who are excited about the profession of interior design. I'm passionate about the profession, not just interior design as a side gig or, you know, something you do for fun. So I'm excited. Come with us as we discover and find out who truly deserves to be Nigeria's first ever interior design star. The glitz, the glamour, Breathtaking pieces <laughs> and invaluable key lessons learned, proving their skills through a journey filled with twists and turns. A little bird told me about some friction that has been that has been going on amongst a couple of contestants. I'm not going to name names. I heard there was a certain push within a certain a certain young lady, small shaped young lady. If you heard, do you know anything about that? <laughs> Ha 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 ha!
Oluchi seems unhappy. I'm not smiling. I was not happy with the judgment, so it was as if I put more of the effort and my teammate was dragging, dragging me down. When you are putting two sheep to feed from the same pot, you know, there will be a confusion. His idea was kind of mean. The two people drew two lines. Every task, from the stylish ambience at the Angelica store. But why I brought this one and that one over there was, I mean, the coffee table is too far. Okay. Like, you know how you get to drink in somebody's house or something and I you have to stretch. Unlike everybody else, I pick just one thing because I believe okay. less is more. Now I'm just trying to be teacher's pet, no, no, but it's no. okay. To a tactful poof challenge at Andrezini's. The challenge today is accessorizing upholstery. So we're giving you a template that is uniform to everybody and you'll get the chance to pick fabrics and accessories. Not so fast and easy. These contestants will have to prove their work. Those hot. Very busy market. Yes. A tidal ride to the color challenge at Pop Beach. Five more minutes. Let's move out, let's move out. But I really like what you guys are doing and I wish you guys all the best. Unfortunately, Shell is going to be back to the drawing board for you. And yes. A dramatic task. Careful there. As they went back to their roots, some were capable. You're the winners of the challenge, and what you get is immunity from the next challenge. So that doesn't mean you're not going to do well, but it just means you can't be eliminated. Not everyone had a saving grace, but the final two are set and ready to battle on the main stage. Down to the final two. Who wins the design course at the prestigious Decor and Rainbow in the UK? First, the contestants make a stop at one of Nigeria's most exquisite design brands, Bow Concept. Bow Concept offers customized, coordinated, and functional design pieces for home or office. Welcome to the finale, everyone. I can't believe it's been nine episodes already. This is episode 10. And as you're probably aware, we're not going to disappoint. Today, we're at Bo Concept Lagos, and we're going to show you some amazing furniture. I'm really looking forward to this episode. So we're right down to the wire now, and we have our finalists. The idea is they're going to be designing with the same resources for the same client. Can you imagine? Let's see what they come up with. We're going to take them through the store and they're going to pick out the items that they're going to use to fulfill this final, final challenge. And as you know, with Interiors by Design, we always have something up our sleeves. What could the mentor, Titi Fawora, have up her sleeves? So guys, here we are. Like I said earlier, Bo Concept. Final two, finale, the biggest challenge of them all. The reason I brought us to Bo Concept, I, I like contemporary design. I wish I don't have a personal design style, but I get towards, I lean towards urban, contemporary, modern design. But what is modern changes? That's another mm -hmm. thing. What's modern today changes. Could be old school from, tomorrow. Yeah, could be old school tomorrow. And I like the way both concepts have had that history. They've been around for over 60 years, so they've evolved and they're, mm. still, they're still contemporary. They're still modern. So there's a lesson to be learned there. Um, we're starting off here with the 
accessories area because I remember that was one of our first lessons. So let's okay. look around. Mm -hmm. Like I always say to you, interact with the furniture, touch things. Mm -hmm. This is where you'll be picking out the items you use for the final challenge. It has been a very wonderful journey so far. The people, the places, the experiences, it has been wonderful. I met some interesting people, shared ideas, very creative minds. It has been a very wonderful journey so far. Yes, I knew I was going to go far. I, I didn't really think of the final stage yet because I didn't even know what activities we were going to be doing. But as we were going through the activities and I was like, Oh yeah, so it can actually be anybody's game, like anything can happen. I learned something very important in this competition. In, you have to give your best every time. There's no room for laxity. You might just decide to relax and that would be it. It may not even be that like you messed up the whole challenge, but it may have been, oh, you missed this really tiny thing and then you were kicked out or thrown back to the drawing board. So at that point I was like, hmm, Am I going to make it to the final stage? Am I not going to make it to the final stage? As the program continued, we bonded, sort of, and, and seeing people go, that has not been easy on any of us. Um, the irony of it was the lady that won was in the bottom in the last challenge, and the lady that lost was in the top, the last challenge. Yes, unfortunately, I was at the bottom of the last challenge. It feels good to be back in the game. It's anybody's game right now. So you can't be um, technically inept. As a, a successful interior designer, you need a well-rounded body of knowledge. You have to have the balance between the practical side and the aesthetic side. The last two challenges, those are stuff that I watch on TV that I pay attention to. It's not like somebody sat me down and explained that this is how it's supposed to be. It's just something I derive pleasure in doing. So I wanted to show you this swatch wall. Another thing that I like about both concepts which they brought to Nigeria is the ability to customize furniture. Okay. So for example, if you like that sofa, but you wanted it in another fabric. They could do that for you, so you can come in, you feel the fabric. Check. You might have your own palette, your own color that you need to, or your own color scheme uh -huh. that you need to work with. And it goes from leather to fabric, different colors, textures, hues. But I actually like this because ah. first of all, it has texture. Okay. Then the threads are of different colors. Varied. Mm. So far, quite interesting. Okay. Whatever we're going through, but at the same time, it's not in your face. Yeah. So it has depth, but it's not loud. Kind of. Yeah. This is too much for me, but something, something like smooth, that. brown and earthy. Okay. You like yeah. earth too. Mm -hmm. yeah. You can't go wrong with things, actually. Ife and Tayo are stunned by some of the beautiful pieces in the space. So much more to see. This chair. Yeah, it has curves in all directions. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> like a nice woman. <laughs> Firm. It looks good. Everything of this chair should be. It has a lot of space. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And nobody has to share with me. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I think the first selfish side is coming out now. We're seeing it. So I like this arrangement as well, but you know, you can just do whatever you want really. That's, that's what we're called to do as designers. And I guess I'm going to leave you guys to take a look around. that might lean towards contemporary design. I always think design is more interesting when it has a history. That's another thing that Bull Concept brings to the table. This chair, excuse the pun, is a classic design that a lot of interior designers would be aware of, but they've also added a modern twist to it. I mean, look at it, it's beautiful, it's contemporary, it's comfortable, it does what a chair should do, and it looks good whilst doing it.
the contestants visit Do2 Design, Nigeria's leading interior solutions provider with excellent global standards. I think it would be criminal to talk about modern interior design in Nigeria without mentioning Mrs. Ifenwa Igodalo. So today, we're at Do2 Designs, one of Nigeria's foremost interior design brands and companies. We'll be looking today at some very interesting furniture for our final task. And what is really sort of interesting to remember is that most of these pieces are made in Nigeria, something we're very proud of, showing the rest of the world what can be done on our shores. So come with me as we take a look at some interesting pieces for our finale. Like I said, this is also contemporary furniture. Contemporary furniture can take different shapes and forms, you know. Bold concept, minimalist, clean lines. Here, it's also contemporary, but warmer, cozier. I wouldn't want to say richer, because then that makes, you know, the other style, it's just different. And yes. you get that a lot with design, so you can have the same style but from a different angle. And then that's where you now have to start thinking about your client, what are their needs, what are their requirements, what would work for them, you know, what is their style like, what is their day-to-day -day life like, what could work for one client and not work for the other. And then you also have the ability or the liberty to mix. That's where your professional skill comes in. The contestants are really attentive, but who's paying attention to key details? Of course I had a game plan in the beginning but of course my game plan was thrown off because the challenges were a bit different. They were not really based on what your past knowledge. They were based more on what like we had treated that day or what had been explained that day. So it was that's when I knew that ugh, this thing is more than my power. Honestly I came in to see what's going on and see if I could because I, I, as ex I expected a lot of talent and I, I met a lot of talent there. So it's, it feels like a very big privilege to be here. Taya, you were saying you were looking at yes, those colors. Very risky for me. Yeah. I would naturally go with this. That's more your comfort yes, zone. Comfort. But you see how it works, mm -hmm. yeah? Everything is cohesive because each piece kind of, like this piece that has the brown, mm. the pillows or they take the green from the chair, from the chair and yeah. the orange from the rock. So yeah. it brings together more of a cohesive concept. At yeah. the end. And then you then have the occasional or the, the accent chairs. And the use of accessories, even where you had clusters that otherwise might look over the top Tight, yes. but because everywhere else is a bit bare it's just about thinking through your arrangement so i want you to bear that in mind when you're doing the the, t the last task interiors by design we always have a little trick or two up our sleeve so i need to leave you with one little one you're allowed to bring back one person to come and help you on your final challenge. So don't tell me now, actually. So you're allowed to bring back one person that's been eliminated to come and help you with the final challenge. But be disciplined about it, so to speak. Think about why you would want that person to come back. What strengths do they bring to the table? What have you seen them do over the course of the season? Why do you think they would be an asset? Don't bring anyone that would be a liability. The time is limited. Wow, what a tough one. Each contestant is allowed to bring back an eliminated contestant to help with the final challenge. Could this be good for them or back to the drawing board? As the mentor warns, don't bring a liability. I'm sure Tayo is also going to come up with an amazing design. It's just going to boil down at the end of the day to whose design is better or whose design is more cohesive. So I pray it's mine. <laughs> You know you are going to choose your best friend. If it's Vivian you are talking about, Vivian's hands are tied. She will take one day off for you. Oh, would you Trust help me? You. you, would you help me? <laughs> okay, I help you. Kind of Abandon your work and help me. Who will it be? I'm curious. Proving their worth and skills, 
It's down to the final two. The contestants will design a space for a mystery client. Who will it be? Any wild guesses? On Interiors by Design, the drama, action and insight never stops. Who did each contestant choose to take them to victory? The substitute contestant gets to help the final two complete their task. Wait, Ty, where's your back up for? I'm calling this person. Hello. If anybody else calls you, don't pick. <laughs> eh? If Ife calls you, don't pick our call. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, boss, thanks. Why are you calling? Why do you want to move? I'm going to block that call. <laughs> <laughs> Did they make the right choice? Share your thoughts on social media with the hashtag Back to the Drawing Board. We would like to hear from you. Follow us on Red TV, Interiors by Design, for more engaging updates. Tune in next week for more on Interiors by Design.